What to expect on your first visit to a doctor of chiropractic. You've decided to visit a doctor of chiropractic, but you're not quite sure what to expect. This information will help you to feel at ease during your first chiropractic appointment. During the first appointment, the doctor will complete a thorough examination. This typically includes a patient history, physical examination, appropriate diagnostic studies, a diagnosis, and a chiropractic treatment plan. Let's look at these closer. As part of your patient history, you will be asked to complete forms that provide background information about your symptoms and condition. Questions may include, when did your pain or condition start? Where is the pain located? Did the pain or condition immediately follow an injury or accident? Does anything improve or worsen it? What treatments have you already tried and what was the outcome? You may also be asked to provide information on family medical history, social history, pre-existing conditions or prior injuries, and previous and current healthcare providers and treatments. Also bring any copies of previous tests such as MRIs, x-rays, and lab results, and a list of medications that you may be taking. The next step is a physical exam to evaluate your condition and develop a working diagnosis. In addition to general physical exam procedures, the examination may include specific tests to assess vital signs such as weight, height, blood pressure, pulse, and respiration, range of motion of the affected area, muscle tone, muscle strength, posture, spinal and or joint stability. Next, imaging or lab studies may be needed to further assist in the diagnostic process. The most commonly used include x-ray, MRI, CT or bone scan, blood and or urine analysis. The combination of history, exam and diagnostic studies will enable your doctor to reach a diagnosis which will help him or her to determine whether chiropractic services are appropriate for your condition. Your doctor will explain the condition, the treatment plan, the anticipated frequency and duration of care, and the risks and benefits of all proposed procedures. If your doctor determines that you would be more appropriately managed or co-managed by another health care professional, he or she will make the proper referral. Through a process of shared decision making, you and your chiropractic doctor will determine if chiropractic services are right for you. If so, your doctor may incorporate specific spinal or joint manipulation or mobilization, often using his or her hands or instruments that may reduce pain and restore or enhance joint function. Based on the extent, timing, or severity of the patient's condition, chiropractic interventions may require numerous visits. Patients also receive advice on home care, lifestyle modifications, exercise instruction, and nutritional advice. Doctors of chiropractic use their conservative first approach to identify the cause of your health concern and to address it. Many people are increasingly interested in achieving optimum health and wellness rather than reliance on prescription medication and other medical interventions. The American Chiropractic Association recommends choosing one of its member doctors who practices ethical, patient-centered, evidence-informed, conservative health care.